afternoon, Istanbul. I would like to thank the Board of Directors of Turyed and also the members for the opportunity to be here today. And also a very special thank you to Ms. Ebru, who invited me to come and speak with you. Uh, I would like to apologize, though, because the translation has not been working this morning, and my Turkish is non-existent, one of the languages I don't speak. So I was not able to hear and understand what the other speakers were saying, unfortunately. So I'm not able to connect what I have to say with what they have to say. And when I was speaking to Ms. Ebru, she basically asked for 15 hours of content, and she said, and you have 15 minutes. <laughs> so please understand that there is so much more that we could talk about when it comes to gastronomy tourism. There, there's, just, there's a mountain of information. This is just the tip of the iceberg. It is impossible to share everything with you in 15 minutes. Uh, next, please. There we go. So when I was asked to speak about uh, the state of gastronomy tourism and Turkey's opportunities, I wanted to do a little research on what the situation was, of course, of Turkey, and to see if I could learn a little bit more. Because Turkish cuisine, Turkish culture is a very interesting thing that really a lot of people outside of Turkey don't know about. So, of course, when we talk about food, dining, we think about restaurants. 